Hello everyone! I'm doing this video as a short update to what happened last week and what's coming up next for the Eternity Crowd project. I would like to share with you a bit of our core values and I really really hope you appreciate this. First I want to say that we observed the 5th of November and we celebrated in our own way. Um, we decided to distribute tokens to everybody that confirmed their MetaMask address to our website before the 2nd of November. So everybody should have their tokens in their wallets now and that was a big celebration for us. Also, uh, the upgrade of the testnet and the smart contract was successful. So uh, all the nodes are migrated now in the new smart contract. It went smooth, so everything is good there. And if you want to join the testnet, feel free to, to, to join Discord and uh, go to the setup step. What I also like to tell you is the next steps and what the project does next. Uh, so far, we managed to secure uh, enough funding to make sure we deliver the core part of the project and we're looking at expanding and on the features right now. So in the next stage, we're raising money for all these features that, uh, that will be delivered with the project. Also, in the next part, very important is the decentralization. Right now, there's a few hundred people that have access to set up a node. So we're looking at expanding it and getting anyone that set up a node involved in the project. And this is done in the next phase. We will release also a short video, one minute video, uh, that explains this, how the community is growing and how we're looking out to decentralize every uh, centralized project. And hopefully, with your help, we can make this bigger and bigger. So all you have to do is look at the, uh, the video and share it with, with everybody that you know. But besides the video, there will be other materials that will come out uh, about the project, uh, some of the interviews because we're we're going to, to Malta. So uh, we will do some content there, which also is helpful to, to understand um, the nature of the project and the impact um, in our society. Now, some of you might be asking, why the heck are doing this last round the way you're doing it? and whether that's risky for the project or not. And the answer is simple. No, that's not risky. It's necessary. There are two reasons for this. The main reason is decentralization. We want to get the project decentralized and be able to be spread all over the world and have nodes in every corner of the world as possible. The second goal is to raise as many funds to ensure a long-term survival and successfulness of the project itself. Then there is a bit of concern about the price because as we are sharing this to other people, the price goes up. Well, let me tell you something about that. The price is linear based on how many people contribute. However, the value of the project as it's decentralized and spread is growing exponentially. Then look at other projects that are the same and they're doing the same we're doing and see at their value. What is their value right now in the market? And then decide for yourself whether this is a good deal or not. Because I can tell you there's projects out there that did nothing. They don't have a test net. They have no intellectual property. They didn't make any steps for that. And they have great success because the community wants to have that in the world. With that being said, it's clear that the best course of action right now is to share all the materials with all your friends and families and everybody you know in your communities because we are growing this large. So everybody is part of it and we want to have everyone part of it. Also, if uh, you happen to be in Malta on 15th of 19th November, we are there at AIPC, we have a booth and we're gonna hang out. So feel free to join, um, just write us on Telegram and otherwise just keep in touch and see you uh, in the chat. 
Bye.